Let's get into what games I played last year. So, yeah, I'm looking at the list of games that were released. Um, uh, Monster Hunter World, oh yeah, that was a fucking awesome game. I have not beat it yet. <laughs> As a matter of fact, it's been like a couple months since I played it. I have not finished it. I got pretty far into it. And then for some reason I just stopped playing it. Uh, which is weird because I was super excited for that game. Oh uh, crap. And like so much uh, stuff has been updated on it. That, you know, if I were to go back and play it, it'll be like, well not completely new, of course. Oh god. Just knocked down my drink. But, uh, you know, I, I don't know, maybe I'll play it again here soon. Uh, it's probably my favorite Monster Hunter game. I, I'm gonna de definitely say that. My favorite Monster Hunter game. Like, no question about it. And I don't need, I don't know what it, what it is. It's like... A lot of people were kind of upset it didn't have a lot of monsters in it. Of what I heard. I think that was a complaint. But... It kind of made up for it for all the other extra stuff they had. Um, added to it, like the fucking monsters fighting other monsters. That was my fa my like favorite like feature of that game. Or one of my favorite features. I think where I stopped is where you first fight the one like spiky dragon. I don't know what the name is. That's around where I stopped. I don't know. Maybe maybe I'll play that again. Oh god. Oh, no, maybe that'll be the game I... Oh god, I keep burping. The game that I test my streams out on. Who knows? Um, I still haven't figured out or decided what game I'm going to do that with. Uh, well. um, let's see. Then, oh, God of War. Probably my favorite game of last year. Definitely. I feel like playing that now. <laughs> God, all these games I want to start playing. Um, I actually want to... It's going to be very hard to do, but I think I want to go back and uh, try to get all the trophies in God of War. Um, I played it on hard mode. I might go back and just play it on normal. And do all that. <laughs> oh, God. Dying. <sighs> um. Yeah. I, again, my favorite God of War, definitely. Even though that's kind of like a completely different series altogether, can't really compare it to really. Uh. That that was fucking an incredible game. I'm super happy you got Game of the Year. Like, it, it definitely deserved it. I really, I think I really like Norse setting versus the Greek setting. Um, and I cannot wait. It, there's definitely going to be sequels. Like, it's not even like a question there's going to be. I just can't wait for that. I have no idea what they're going to do with it. <laughs> like, I have an idea. It probably has something to do with uh, Ragnarok and all that. As a matter of fact, before the game came out, I like started reading about uh, Norse mythology just so I could understand the references and all that that were in the games. Like the fucking Dorf brothers, like I knew who they were, and all like the gods like Baldur, fucking, uh, uh, fucking Thor, yeah that's his name, how could I not remember? <laughs> Like how, how he actually is in the stories. Yeah, yeah. I just have not again I have no idea what they're gonna do for the next game. But I look forward to that. And then there's Spider-Man. Ooh. I think that might be my second favorite of this year. I still have not played the DLCs. Which uh, now that I'm thinking about it, I might go back and do that. Although no. 
No, again, I gotta do the textures. I got, I gotta fix that up. Probably finish some of that by tonight. Uh, but I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. Well, I mean, considering tomorrow I won't be able to stream, maybe I can just push it off until tomorrow. No, I don't know. Maybe I'll do that. And then... Uh, no, no, I'll keep talking about Spider-Man. <laughs> um, yeah, that I think the Batman Arkham games... I think are still my favorite like superhero kind of um, like video games. Like I like all three games, but this one was like very. It's definitely second place. Um, I don't know what it is about Batman Arkham that I like more than Spider Man. Uh, if I had more time to think, then I'd probably think of why. But definitely my second favorite of this year is Spider Man. And I can't I can't wait to play the DLCs. Like I have them downloaded. I bought them already. And I'm not even playing them. Pretty sure all three are out right now. And the first DLC was kinda of spoiled for me. So I kinda kinda of know like the big surprise or whatever that's in that game. However I don't know, it doesn't well probably deter my like the fun I have with that. Um yeah. I think I think that's probably second place for my 2018 games that I played. Uh, oh yeah, there's the new. Let me see. Uh, po new Pokemon game. That. Oh. <laughs> All right, the new new. So let's let's go Eevee. I think. Like, I, I like, okay. I like that game, right? Sorry, you gonna stay. Okay. Yeah, I, I like that game. However, it... I, I miss the old formula. Like, like definitely. And because of that, I'm like, I'm like itching for the new one that's probably gonna come out this year. I think it's been confirmed it's going to come out this year, actually. But, uh, yeah. So, one of the things, not the gameplay, not, not like the story or anything, but the thing I don't like the most about it, the fucking melody and stuff. Like, I don't really like Pokemon Go. Like, like seriously. Or, I don't like how you have to play it in order to get the... Mel Melmetal, I think it is. I think it's called. I really don't like that. All right, hold on, I got sneeze. Huh? <coughs> oh god. What was I saying? <laughs> uh, but that, that's kind of just like personal thing. That didn't really take away from the experience as a whole. Um, I, I liked it. I just, again, missed the old formula of that game. Still a pretty good game. Pretty good Pokemon game. Not my favorite, but you know. Oh yeah. <laughs> so I have Super Smash Bros. Ultimate, but I've not even played it. Like it's in my Switch right now, but I've not even played it. So I can't really say anything about that. Uh, what other games? Well, seventy six. I've not played. Ooh, Octopath Traveler. I'm currently playing that. That, that was a game that was really released last year, but I bought it like, kind of late in the year. Actually, in December, I bought it. And, uh... I have not beat it yet, but that very good. Very good game. I can't really, really say much about that. Um... What other games? Okay, there's like a shit ton of games that came out. Oh yeah, the Dark Souls Remember. <gasps> oh, Spyro Reignited. Death Paw. Oh, I love that game. Love those games, I should say. Like, I beat those 
in like three, four days, like a hundred percent. Actually, okay, more like a week. But I love the original trilogy. And I loved this one. Like, I don't even mind like the redesigns. Like, that's fucking petty stuff. I'm complaining about that. Wait, did I do? No, I'm, I'm, I need to do the index. What am I doing? There we go. <laughs> um, yeah, I, I really loved how, like, <laughs> how cat-like uh, Spyro was that they made. I loved how, like, in the first game where every single dragon that you rescued was, like, a unique, like, character, basically. That was really awesome, how they remade everything. Of course, all the levels were all the same, so I knew exactly what everything was, where everything was. But it was the biggest nostalgia trip I've <laughs> experienced in a long time. And I hope the Resident Evil 2 remake does that to me. I mean, I know it's like basically a rehaul. Probably not going to be even close to how the original was. In terms of all the locations, so I'm sure they're gonna need to switch that up to make it like more fresh, not just be exactly how it was. But Spire re reignited, definitely. I'm gonna put that at, like third place <laughs> of my favorite games last year. So now it's like God of War, uh, Spider-Man, and Spyro. And then, uh, oh yeah, Detroit Become Human. I really like that as well. Uh, <laughs> the I got a shit ending though. Um, I think I got. Um, is Marco the? I think Marco is the one that's like the leader of the androids. And his ending, he got a he got a good ending. Uh, he like you know. Yeah, I got the good ending. <laughs> and then the same with Connor. I got a good ending with him. But, uh, fucking... Kara. She... Got fucked up. In my... <laughs> in my first playthrough. She kinda... Uh... What was the kid's name? I don't remember the kid's name. That was with her. But, uh, she died. <laughs> in my playthrough. I should probably play that again. Maybe get all the alternate paths and all that. I don't know. I, I feel like I shouldn't replay it because that first experience really sticks with you. So if I had to replay, I don't want it to like tarnish that first playthrough a bit. So of course the other ones won't feel as impactful, I don't think. Uh, but that's just me. In general though, pretty awesome game. Like I really like Heavy Rain. This felt like definitely like an upgrade it's definitely like an upgrade from the previous game that quantum dream did which was a uh, god two souls and there were choices in that game but they didn't really matter in the end because you basically got to pick your own got to pick your ending you didn't really like your actions didn't influence the ending really you just picked which one you wanted, at least as far as I knew, that it was set up like. But uh, yeah, Detroit, where would I place that? Maybe fifth, fifth place, I don't know. Well, what other games came out? Uh, yeah, Fallout 76. I think the Nino Cutie too came out. But I didn't play that. Uh, oh, there she goes. <laughs> oh yeah, Make Me I'm Living. I haven't played that either. But I definitely want to go back into that. I don't know. It's definitely a lot. Yeah. Okay. I'm just like yeah. I'm just looking at all the. There's Mino Cooney, Captain Toad. 
Pokemon game. Uh, oh yeah, that VR game Moss came out. Dragon Quest 9. Or 10. Is it 9 or 10? Oh yeah, and uh, Hollow Knight was re-released for the, the Switch as well. I've not played that, but that was that seems like a very interesting game. That I want to play someday. Uh, but yeah, okay. So, if I had a, a top five, I guess, it would be God of War, Spider-Man, Spyro Reignited Trilogy, Monster Hunter of World, and then Detroit Become Human. So yeah, there you go. It's the games I played last year. 